This band is a very, very important band that we should learn, not only for joy brackets, but also for evolution of complicated brackets, which has 3D control. These bands are designed in order to close spaces after we finish the alignment of the teeth. Now, the alignment of the teeth is one of the first stages we do in our treatment sequence. We first do alignment, we correct all rotations, we correct all the in and out, we correct all the up and down. Now, if there were spaces or we have extracted teeth, now we want to close the spaces. So, one of the first thing we do is stabilize all the segments. How we stabilize the segments? We take metal ligature and we create figure eight around all these three segments. After we have done all these three segments, we are uh, doing the wire, which is usually a rectangular stiff wire, like 16 by 22 stainless steel. We are putting the bands, the mushroom passive bands, close to the cuspid. So the space between cuspid and cuspid will not be open when you retract the teeth. So we create this mushroom shape. And then we take the wire and create some compensation bands horizontally and vertically in order to avoid the teeth from tilting. When we close the spaces, we want to close bodily. We don't want to have tilting. So when we have the chance for tilting, we will do a reverse curve in the wire in order to overcome this tendency. So we will learn in this hands-on part how to do this complicated wire for space closure step. For this purpose of the exercise, uh, you will use uh, metal ligature. To do figure eight is very easy. You go with the ligature down the bracket, up the bracket. I usually do it under the wire and so I can put the wire inside and not uh, do not need later on to replace this metal ligature. I'm using uh, to cut the metal ligature I use a normal cutter and I have here also a lingual uh, a ligature director. You can see it is angulated 45 degrees. Okay, very useful. Of course, you start by preparing the passive mushroom bands. I check the wire to see that it is passive. Okay, and I have the mushroom bands. And now I will show you how we make the compensation for the Boeing effect. When we close the space, we don't want the, the we want to avoid the tendency for the teeth to tilt. And that's why we will make an opposite band in the wire. So this band should be made both in the horizontal and in the vertical. So that's the way how we do it. I hold the light wire plier and with my hand I just with one movement I create this horizontal shape. 
uh, band. You can compare now the right part to the left part. Now automatically I get also a vertical movement which I will now a little bit enlarge so now I have both vertically and horizontally now when you want to know if the band is big enough just imagine where you cut the wire if this is your arch the wire will be cut eventually here so now you can see that the band that we have made is too small so I take now and, and I enlarge the band a little bit in both dimension both horizontally and vertically so now you will be able to see the effect of this band on the uh, arch the molar will get some anti-rotation movement the premolar will have a tendency to move inside which is very good in this case and we will level the curve of speed this band should be made on rectangular wire Thank you and I would love to see you in my next movies. Bye.